Hello. You guys, I screwed up. <laughs> Obviously I'm here at Stash and I'm here an hour early. I thought my student was at 10, but they're not until 11. But it's a really cute story. It's a daughter and stepmom. Um, and the daughter is surprising her stepmom with a sewing class. I guess the stepmom was kind of not complaining, but just, you know, talking about how she, you know, wanted to like enhance her skills a little bit. Um, apparently she just finished her first quilt, but she also has two machines already. So I'm a little bit like, I don't know where we're going to, I don't know where the stepmom is at in terms of her skill level, but she wanted the daughter to take the class with her. The daughter's never sewn before. So um, it should be a fun experience for all. But yeah, I'm here way too early. <laughs> um, I did bring a project. I'm actually finishing up the sew along that um, went live today. You guys are about to be bombarded with videos. Bombarded, I have so many. I have to catch up on, what's it called, Vlogmas. Then I filmed all my works in progress like the little stack that I got out of that closet. And that ended up being like almost 30 minutes. So that's gonna be a separate video now. Then I've got the sew along, which is five videos. Then I have a first impression filmed, ready to go. So yeah, we're just gonna be cranking them out. So hopefully you guys are not super busy doing anything other than watching YouTube videos. I know it's a crazy time of year. Maybe these can just be your like, <laughs> wind down <laughs> i'll be your wind down every day after all the chaotic shopping and wrapping and everything else that you guys have got to do so i gotta say this is pretty relaxing way to sew um no dogs nice big bright space feeling very happy um okay so the dress is done for all intents and purposes i didn't hem it though not even in the sew along because i figured i was probably going to want to make it longer just like knee length dresses are not my vibe right now. So um, I wanna make it longer by adding a tier. Um, I think that the, the flowy vibe of it kind of lends itself to that anyways. So I put it on and I measured like where the bottom of my fingertips are and that's where I'm gonna cut it. And then I'm gonna add one tier and then, so I'm cutting off six inches so I might add, cause so I'll cut off six, add eight, and that'll be like just below my kneecap. And then we'll see where we are with that. I might add another one, but I didn't want the, I didn't want the ruffle to start at my knee. I felt like that felt weird. So it's like mid thigh now. And then the ruffle will be nice and long and really big and gathered and all that good stuff. So, I mean, in my mind, that makes sense. Am I about to ruin this dress? <laughs> I don't think so. I have plenty of fabric. It's gonna be fine. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> Here goes nothing. Okay. No turning back now. <laughs> I've got a mini skirt. All right, so I have all this fabric. So I'm gonna cut nine. I'm gonna do nine inches. I'll do 10 and then hem it. Yeah, 10. Oh gosh, okay. So yeah, I'm gonna finish this dress, teach the daughter and stepmom and then go home for a couple of hours probably and then um they're doing a taylor swift themed pop-up so it's like homemade not homemade but it's like you know the people that make earrings and they'll make like you know like a craft fair that's not even the right thing either what is it called like when you just make your own product and then you sell it at like different festivals and stuff it's like that but it's supposed to be all taylor swift themed so we'll see exactly how taylor swift themed people got like is it just the colors or is it actually like taylor swift's face everywhere um so a friend of mine and i are going to go to that and then they do have a holiday market um, somewhere that we were also going to try and go to. Um, I don't need any of that stuff, so I'm not planning on buying any of it, but I do like to look at it all. And it, I don't know, it's like one of the things I actually really enjoy about the holidays is 
these big, these big markets where you can go, you know, look at all the pretty stuff. 